Welcome to Sports Live Media on YouTube. It's your guy, Sports Live, with another video for today. Um, the Alabama High School Athletic Association has been having high school regional basketball play for boys and girls at four different sites. The regionals started February 13th, and they go through like the 22nd or 23rd. So this video today is just a summary of the Alabama High School Athletic Association regionals that have taken place from February 13th of 2024 through yesterday, February 16th of 2024. Um, anyway, the regional sites are as follows. For the Northwest Regionals, they're held at Wallace State Community College in Hansville. The Northeast Regionals are being held at the uh, Jacksonville State University. Uh, the Central Regionals are being held at the Bill Harris Arena in Birmingham. And the South Regionals are being held um, in Montgomery. So with that being said, let's just get into this. The on February 13th, the only regional that was going on was at the Northeast Regionals at Jacksonville State University. So in 7A girls in the semifinals for the regionals, uh, Hewitt Trustville 64, Grissom 22. In the 7A boys semifinal, it was Grissom 47, Chelsea 38. Uh, in, the, uh, in the other 7A girls semifinal, it was Chelsea 40, Spartman 28. In the other boys' 7A semifinal, it was Huntsville 56, Oak Mountain 38. Now, most of the regionals started all and started kicking off on February 14th. So let's just start with the Northeast Regional summary for February 14th. Spring Garden 75, Appalachian 25, and that was a 1A girls semifinal. In a 1A boys' semifinal, it was Spring Garden 60, Appalachian 30. Uh, 1A girls semifinal, Skyline 44, Winterboro 39. 1A boys semifinal, Skyline 59, Faith Christian 32. Uh, let's see. In the uh, 7A, or in the Northwest Regionals, which took place on February 14th as well, you had the 7A girls semifinal, Bob Jones 40, Vestavia Hills 37. 7A boys semifinal, you had Thompson 63, James Clemens 43. 7A girls semifinal, Hoover 58, James Clemens 46. 7A boys semifinal, Hoover 65, Austin 49. In the 1A girls semifinal, Meek 34, Belgreen 54. Oh, uh, let's see, the 1A boys semifinal, Shoals Christian 68. Lynn, 51, 1A Girls Semifinal, Shoals Christian, 56, Marion County, 63, 1A Boys Semifinal, Covenant Christian, 66, Marion County, 57. Next, we'll move to the Central Regionals. In 7A Girls Semifinal, Foley, 64, Central Phoenix City, 57. In the 7A Boys Semifinal, Fairhope's uh, 63, Central Phoenix City, 83, 7A Girls Semifinal, Auburn, 63, Daphne, 57, in the 7A Boys Semifinal, it was Daphne, 80, Auburn, 69, 1A Girls Semifinal, it was Keith, 68, Otagaville, 52, in the 1A Boys Semifinal, it was Keith, 44, Calhoun, 48, in the 1A Girls Semifinal, Calhoun 45, Billingsley 34. In the 1A Boys Semifinal, R.C. Hatch 51, South Lamar 69. Uh, next, we have the South Regionals. Prattville 76, Alma Bryant 30 uh, in women's basketball. Baker 67, uh, Jag 49 in the boys' uh Enterprise and Davidson played in a game. There's no information available on that game. Uh, Enterprise, 60. Mary G. Montgomery, 49. Georgiana, 37. Elba, 41. Uh, Georgiana, 81. Florala, 55. Leroy, 44. Marengo, 19. McIntosh, 67. Southern Choctaw, 35. Uh, next, we'll go to the regional action starting on February 15th. For the Northeast Regionals, you had 5A Girls Semifinal, Southside 56, Moody 45. 
In the 5A boys semifinals, we had Guntersville 69, Sardis 63. In the 5A girls semifinal, you had Scottsboro 54, Springville 38. In the 5A boys semifinals, you had Scottsboro 57, you had Leeds at 33. Okay, let's move on with that. Uh, okay. Next, you have the Northeast region or the Northwest Regionals on February 15th. You had the 6A girls semifinal, Hartzell 50, Muscle Shoals 46. In the 6A boys semifinal, it was Coleman 56, Muscle Shoals 51, and I believe that game went to overtime. 6A girls semifinal, you had Hazel Green 57, Clay Chalkville 29. 6A boys semifinal, Buckhorn 61, Clay Chalkville 51. In the 2A girls semifinal, you had Whitesburg Christian 30, Decatur Heritage 51. Uh, in the 2A boys semifinals, it was Tanner 63, Decatur Heritage Christian Academy 49. In the 2A girls semifinal, it was Mars Hill Bible 61, Sullivan 43. 2A boys semifinals, Mars Hill Bible 59, Red Bay 28. For the Central Regionals for February 15th, you had the 6A girls semifinal, Hillcrest Tuscaloosa 51, McAdory 19. In the 6A boys semifinals, it was Paul Bryant 46, McAdory 47. In the 6A girls semifinals, it was Pelham 41, Chilton County 35. In the 6A boys semifinals, it was Helena 70, Benjamin Russell 65. In the 2A girls semifinal matchup, it was Locust Fork 56, Cornerstone 34. In the 2A boys semifinals, Locust Fork 72, Francis Marion 56. Uh, in the 2A girls semifinals, Cold Springs 66, Vincent 26. Uh, the 2A boys semifinal, Altamont 65, BB Comer 57. For the South Regionals uh, for February 15th, uh, in the girls' action, you had Pike Road 51, Theodore 36. Uh, in the Park Crossing Sydney Lanier game, there's no stats available. Uh, Cottonwood 39, Abbeville 35 in girls' action. Clark County 66, Abbeville 54 in boys' action. For the Luverne Washington County girls' game, no stats available. Uh, Highland Home, 46. St. Luke's, 36. That was boys action. Uh, Russell County and Carver Montgomery, there are no stats available for that game. Sorry about that. Next, we'll move to February 16th. In the Northeast Regionals, 6A Girls Semifinals, Oxford, 54. Shades Valley, 71. 6A Boys Semifinals, Mountain Brook 62, Gardendale 42. In the 6A Girls Semifinal, Huffman 40, Minor 32. Uh, in the 2A Boys uh, Semifinal, Altamont 65, BB Comer 57. Uh, let's see, in the South Regionals for February 15th. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, I already went over that. All right, let's move on to the next page then. Uh, okay, 6A boys semifinal, I apologize. Homewood 60, Huffman 47. The 2A girls semifinal, Sand Rock 51, Eider 62. The 2A boys semifinal, Gaston 67, North Sand Mountain 61. In the 2A girls semifinal, it was Pisgah 58, Lynette 47. In the 2A boys semifinal, uh, no final score for Lafayette and section. No other information is available. Sorry about that. Uh, in the Northwest Regionals at Wallace State Community College for February 16th, Jasper 63, West Point 39, and that was the Class 5A girls semifinals. In the Class 5A boys semifinals, it was Ramsey 74, Russellville 43. In the Class 5A girls semifinals, it was Pleasant Grove 50, Ramsey 21. In the Class 5A boys semifinals, it was Fairfield 62, Madison Academy 57. In the Class 
3A girls semifinal. It was Clements 78, Childersburg 38. Okay, let's see. I'm sorry. I'm looking through my stuff as we're talking. Oh, okay. Now we have the Class 3A boys semifinal. Danville 49, Winfield 42. And the Class 3A girls semifinal was Lauderdale County 74, Midfield 37. In the Class 3A boys semifinal, Carbon Hill 54, Midfield 61. Uh, there were several games that were played at the Central Regionals on February 16th. And um, at the time of this video, no stats were available for any of those games. So um, in order to get the stats later, you may go to the Alabama High School Athletic Association website and find it. But I don't have anything available for that on February 16th for the Central Regional. So next we'll go to the South Regional for February 16th. Uh, in the girls' action, it was Eufaula 50, Vigor 50, uh, 49 in girls' action. Vigor Boys 69, Eufaula 65. Gulf Shores Girls 45, St. Paul 38. Uh, in boys' action, Charles Henderson 50, Headland 29. Uh, and that was in boys' action. In boys' action, it was Hillcrest Evergreen, 86, Pike County, 51. Um, let's see. Strawn versus Brockton. There's uh, no information available on that one. Uh, Cottage Hill, 40. Houston Academy, 24 for the girls. Providence Christian, 33. Cottage Hill, 49 for the boys. And that is all of the information that I have for the regionals that's been going on for the high school boys and girls in basketball from February 13th through February 16th. I will be doing another video that will highlight the games from February 17th, February 19th, and February 20th. Um, and I'll put that video out sometime later on February 20th regarding how things have gone from that point. Anyway, with that being said, please hit the like button, please hit the notification bell, please uh, hit the subscribe button, and that way you'll know when I'm going live, when I have uh, these sports stats videos, when I have sports education videos. I hope you all have a wonderful day.